Welcome to everyone, particularly to the experts that we have up here. And thank you for joining Religions for Peace Asia on this very special occasion. should be characterized by peace. It is up to us, the genuine practitioners of religion, to manifest to this wounded world the true face of religion and in so doing, manifest the face of God who lives in us. Thank you for your commitment to dialogue and thank you for your commitment to fraternity and solidarity. Religion itself is just a means to realize love toward our neighbor and heal the suffering people. But unfortunately, religion itself in the history of humankind become the objective on the road of peace. So we should repent this and I wish today's Peace Forum to be the good occasion to think about what is the real goal and what is the real function of religions. Let us continue to have these kinds, these kinds of conversations to our religious and interfaith leaders and fellow peace builders attending this forum. Thank you for sharing your knowledge, time, and expertise. Your presence here is invaluable as we pursue our common vision of bringing a just and lasting peace to our nation. Because Islam is defined as Ummatan wasatan, meaning the religion between other religions. But working for peace and restoring tranquility of order tranquility of order. As a great and ancient Catholic theologian described peace, is the result of long, persevering work. Peace in Mindanao is the work of solidarity, unity, mutual collaboration of peoples of different faiths and cultures. Family and the honor of the community again depends on the gender of the women and because it is the women who are violated in conflicts, women when they are violated, they are rejected by their own men and therefore women need to have a positive role in peace building. I concluded with a heart of peace and love is the ultimate basis for a fair and just peace. Sometimes we hear the stereotypes, men work with their minds, while women work with their hearts. We need to work together to dialogue, to inspire each other through cooperation and not conflict, because we have to set examples for the youth to motivate them. As we read a statement in the preface of UNESCO, the world begins from the mind of a human being. Therefore, it is also our human mind that we should first build the fortress of a peace. And this is the role of religions. <laughs>